patterns. In this module, you will learn to identify different patterns. Rhea and her son Sid are sitting in the living room watching TV. They are watching a show on animal life in a zoo. Sid notices that there are black and white strips on the body of zebra, which covers its whole body. He also notices that there are black spots on the body of leopard, which are repeating and cover the whole body. Sid points to the TV screen and asks his mother if these are a kind of patterns. Rhea tells him that he is correct. These are patterns formed by repetition of colors alternately. Let us see some more patterns formed by colors. Look at this pattern. Here one type of shape with different colors is used to make a group. And this group is repeated to make a pattern. Similarly, we have these two patterns. Look at these patterns. Here, position of an object is changed to make a group. On repeating this group, we get a pattern. Similarly, we have these two patterns. Let us see some more patterns. Look at these patterns. Here we get a pattern by increasing the number of shapes or objects. Notice the number of shapes in each pattern. We can see many such patterns around us. Pattern in an iron fence. Pattern in a brickwork. Pattern in floor tiles. Pattern in roofing. Pattern in pots. Pattern in a football. Pattern in a wallpaper. Let's recap. Here we have seen different kinds of patterns. We have also learnt that a pattern can be made by changing colors, positions or a number of objects.